sudden this bird hit me on the top of the head. I wasn't sure it was a bird at first. Be on the lookout for a dive bombing bird in downtown Des Moines. It's picking on runners and walkers over the Des Moines River Center Street Dam. And that's where we find Todd Magel tonight. Todd, is the bird still there? You know, we look for him, but I think he might be tucked in tonight because, of course, it's dark out. He was on that pole here right next to the arch here along the Des Moines River, but believe me, you will see he was wide awake earlier today. Perched high on a light pole, the red winged blackbird sings a happy tune until a jogger goes by. And that's when the attack begins bird versus man or woman. I actually felt the claws grab, grab my uh, hair and head right there, and then it kind of pulled a little bit, and that was it. It happened to Brian Creighton, a visiting airline pilot, and to Brad Tomey, a regular runner who's tangled with this angry bird before. It scares me at first. It really does. I don't know if he's going to attack me or if he's trying to be my friend. In the short time our cameras were here, the blackbird was relentless, swooping down to peck at anybody who gets too close. Sometimes it's a knock on the head, sometimes a pull of the hair. A few victims knew he was there. Others got a big feathered surprise. It's swooping at just about anybody. So if you're lucky, it's on somebody else's trail when you come by the other way and it, and it leaves you alone. <laughs> the experts say this angry blackbird is probably just protecting a nest and some babies here in the weeds next to the river. And once the babies grow up, the dive bombing blackbird will probably just fly away. Until then, beware, the bird sneak attack will probably continue. Think Des Moines' own version of an old Alfred Hitchcock horror film. I think we've all seen the movie The Birds. Well, we've got one of those birds. Now, keep in mind, these birds do have claws, but we haven't heard about any kind of injuries. Uh, only as you saw, there may be some pulled hair on one of the unsuspecting uh, walkers. Todd, how long has this been going on? You know, we got an email saying this has been going on for several days, and probably since those babies are still growing, it may go on several more until they get old enough to, to fly away. All right, Todd, thanks.